Hi everyone, this is Awesome Apps with Umar Siddiqui and today I have for you a new translation app called Fleeto. So without further ado, let's start the app. So as soon as you start the app, you get your uh, news feed and news feed basically is configurable. You can decide uh, who to add in your news feed and then this news feed will basically show up here and if it is not in English or not in your native language you can get it translated uh, next tab that we have here is uh, add more accounts into your newsfeed from social media so you'll find some suggestions over here like Adam Lambert, uh, AC Milan uh, and you can add any of accounts these are Twitter accounts so you can add any of these accounts into your newsfeed for example let's add um, let's see if I can find something interesting over here uh, duh, duh, duh. okay Avril Lavigne so let's add Avril Lavigne to my newsfeed so I just tap here it says please wait and hopefully it will be added successfully yes it did so next time when I go to my newsfeed I will see updates from Avril Lavigne okay I don't see any right now so now uh, this is basically you know translation uh, crowdsourced translation kind of app so you can add any account from social media uh, from from this screen okay uh, so if there's uh, your favorite account is not in there you can request it over here it says requested so you request it and then you can add Twitter or Instagram account and then uh, you just have to enter the account name of any account that you want to add over here the only requirement is that the account should have 100,000 plus followers to be added so it has to be a fairly popular account you know a celebrity or or, or a news channel or something that has lots of followers uh, you can add that account over here and then when you add that account when you add the account uh, okay how do we go back okay when you add the account uh, then there has to be there have to be a specific number of translators for example uh, this uh, Japan fan club if I tap on 8% it means uh, there are only 8% translators uh, of 8% of the minimum translators required uh, to successfully add this account so we have 6 out of 20 English translators no Arabic one Chinese one German 10 Japanese 8 Korean and so on so we need uh, all these translators in different languages uh, to to join this account and then this will be publicly available so right now this app supports a uh, specific number of languages which they are adding uh, so if you speak a language which is not supported by this app at the moment uh, I hope it will be added very soon so when you uh, okay so uh, in this screen translate you can translate any new translation requests okay so new uh, you can see new translation requests over here okay there's nothing for me because the languages I speak uh, English of course I speak and then the other languages that I speak is Urdu which is not currently supported by this app so I don't see anything uh, in translate uh, under request I can request uh, to translate anything so 
I tried it out earlier. Uh, I just wrote a phrase over here uh, in English. Hello, today the weather is really great. I'm planning to go to the beach. And I requested this to be translated to French. So I received a few translations done by other users of the app. As you can see, here's one translation. Here's another one. Here's another one. I'm not even going to attempt to read it because my French is really rusty at the moment so it will not sound very good. So so basically this translation is not computer generated, it's actually translated by real people just like you and me so more reliable translation that, that you can actually use uh, for your research or if you are, if you are learning a language and you want to know how specific a uh, phrase is, is is said in a specific language uh, you can use that use this app to request a translation and then in the social media if if you come across something that's not in english or not in your native language but let but that language is supported by this app then you can request to add that account here and once if that account is popular enough and if there are enough translators available to translate that then that account will be added and then you will be able to uh, read the news feed read, read you know the the new items in your news feed in your native language uh, and if you are a translator uh, whenever you translate something you get points for it and those points then you can spend uh, in different ways you can donate it you can you can you can buy stuff you know there are lots of options over here uh, and so basically you know you are sort of like uh, getting paid to translate okay here's the setting so my language is right now it's only english uh, and then the additional language is urdu which is not currently supported by this app but nevertheless this is a very neat app and as soon as they support Urdu, I will definitely offer my services to translate from uh, Urdu to English or English to Urdu, and uh, and and then we'll see how it goes. But but at this point, I really like the concept. Uh, the world is is you know turning into a global village, and the language barrier is is no more uh, a barrier. You know, it's no longer a challenge because you can easily get stuff translated into your own language. So that's all for today. Hope you like it. Uh, I'm, I'll be waiting for your uh, comments in the comment section. Thanks and bye.